Hey guys, Ricardo here. Welcome to another Blog Tech Tips. And of course, guys, today I'm going to show you how to tell when a app is compatible or not with your M1 MacBook. All right. So of course, here we have the MacBook Air M1. Will also apply to the MacBook Pro. All right. So how do you know when an app is not compatible? It's very easy. All right. So on the desktop, all right now I have two apps. One is compatible and the other is not. Now, of course, um, of course let me show you what happens when you try to install a compatible app if we click you'll notice this option right here that shows the application and uh, notice it says Firefox and it shows you to install it all you gotta do is um, simply drag and drop the icon so simply click so on here click the mouse pad once you do guys drag and drop the Firefox itself into said folder over here all right, so once you drop this into the folder of apps, it will be a part of your apps. All you have to do is um, come down here, go to Launcher, and of course in Launcher, the app will be there. All right, so that's it for a compatible app. So Firefox has been updated and it does work um, great with the M1 MacBook. However, if we were to use this as an example here of an app that doesn't work, if you install um, uTorrent, You'll notice here it shows if you try to install this app, you'll notice that it does show that it's not compatible. And you'll know this because, of course, you see the X. So that means that this cannot be installed. You'll have to wait until this particular app is updated or a newer version is released that's compatible with the M1 chip before this can actually work. So this means that this is not compatible. If you try to drag and drop, notice there's a strike through. And if you place it over at the applications folder, it will fail. So that's how to know when an app is compatible or not with your M1 MacBook. In most cases, it's best to simply try and then see. And of course, you can use the comment section to make a note of which apps currently does not work or works with the M1 MacBook or M1 MacBook for the Pro version or for the MacBook Air or other versions. All right, guys. Hope this was um, useful. As always, guys, Ricardo Gardner from Blog Tech Tips. Same man. Till next time. Bye.